Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to discuss about the host mission and target mission. Let's get started. So in one of our earlier video that is the what is a computer program video we discussed what is a computer program and what is the basic flow for creating simplest program for a computer or a microcontroller this is the example that we discussed in that video right so if you have not watched that video please go back to that video and then come back to this video for better understanding in this example you can clearly see the flow for writing the program for computer or a microcontroller so in this example the program is either written for a computer or for a microcontroller let's take the first example that is the program written for a computer so the computer in the earlier example is nothing but the host machine because when you write a program for a computer you just tend to develop a program or you will be writing a program in this computer for this computer and the program written will be compiled by a compiler that is available in this computer and the program will be executed in the same computer that is the same machine so that is why this computer is called as host machine and let's take the second example that is the program written for a microcontroller so the microcontroller in that example is nothing but the target machine or target device because when you write a program for a microcontroller we cannot develop a program in this microcontroller or we can say that we cannot use this microcontroller for developing a program for the same microcontroller right so in such a case what we will do is we will use a standalone IDE which uses several compilers suitable for this microcontroller and we will be developing the program required for that microcontroller and once the program is successfully compiled we will be dumping and executing the program written in the microcontroller. So the execution happens over here in this microcontroller and the program development happens in this host machine that is the computer. So the standalone program written for the microcontroller in the host machine will be executed in the microcontroller. So here in this example the computer or the host machine will be acting as a cross compiler because it is creating a program which needs to be executed in another machine that is the target device that is microcontroller. I hope you understood what is a host machine and what is a target device or target machine in this video. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.